Welcome to the Collateral Consequences Calculator. The purpose of this tool is to aid lawyers in assessing the potential consequences of conviction for certain crimes outside of the normal sentences of incarceration or fines. This early version of the calculator only provides information on consequences to immigration status for non-U.S. citizens and eligibility for public housing in New York City. Before we begin, please remember that the purpose of this site is not to provide legal advice and that attorneys should use the information here as a starting point in evaluating charges and plea bargain offers. When you first log into the calculator, you will be at the home page, which may already be familiar to you. Notice the column of blue text on the left side of the page. The calculator organizes its information according to the criminal offense charged, allowing you to quickly locate the specific charges the defendant faces. The blue text can be clicked, which will reveal deeper levels of information. If the triangle next to the text is pointing right, this means there is another level of information which you can access by clicking. If the arrow is pointing down, then that branch of information is fully expanded. To access information for the relevant charge, simply click on the appropriate link in the sidebar. After clicking on the name of the offense, the calculator will display potential collateral consequences organized according to probability of the consequence attaching to a defendant depending on his or her circumstances. The consequences are also sorted into housing and immigration categories. If you are only concerned with one type of consequence, you can click on the appropriate tab to display only one type. One of the calculator's most useful functions is the ability to compare offenses to identify desirable plea outcomes. Notice that the list of links on the left now has the header, Compare this offense with. Following the same procedure as before, you can select a different offense and the calculator will display the collateral consequences of both offenses. As you can see, if the defendant is convicted of a crime involving a lesser intent, the collateral consequences in immigration become less certain. If you need or want to know how we have defined a crime involving moral turpitude for the purposes of the calculator, you can click on that link. A new window or tab will open, displaying basic information on what makes a crime involving moral turpitude. Similarly, if you see text along the lines of deportable if, clicking on that link will bring you to information on the circumstances that would give rise to the consequence or deportability for that charge, along with warnings about other potential pitfalls an attorney should consider even if the conditions for deportability under that particular ground for deportation have not been met. The calculator also has an integrated search function. Use the search function if you know the name of the charging offense, but are not sure of what category the offense would fall under. For example, if I know that my client is charged with welfare fraud, I can type the word fraud into the search box and hit the enter key or click the search button. The calculator will display all relevant search results from which we can select the relevant charge. Here, we've selected welfare fraud in the fifth degree. Thank you for viewing this tutorial. You may view it as many times as you like. We appreciate any feedback on the calculator or this tutorial. To send us feedback, simply click on the Send Feedback link in the upper right corner of the page. This concludes the interactive demonstration. Thank you for visiting the Collateral Consequences Calculator.